Good evening. Hi, everybody. So put a comment if you join in live. Let's see who's on this evening. Uh, if you join in live, let me know. And I'll give you a number for a chance to win 50 mil of this gin. So, good evening. I've just decided to do this. So if you don't many people watch, do you know what? Then you'll win, won't you? Uh, good evening, hello, it's Kate here from Sip and Share. Usual Friday night spot. If you are on uh, and you watch, join in, comment, and I'll give you a number. And at the end, we'll pick, we'll do a lucky dip. We've done it every week now, a couple of weeks. Hi, Louisa, number one for you. Number one, number one. Let's get a little pen. A pen. Uh, another fantastic Friday, yes. Let's hope another troll-free fantastic Friday. Number one, Louisa. Number two, Heather. Hello. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to let this run for the first five minutes. One, Louisa. Two, Heather. Three, Joe. Love seeing these names. Joe, you're number three. Hello, folks. Let's do it. I thought I've been gifted this beautiful bottle of gin from Second Son. Uh, Linda, number four. Linda Beard. Hi, Linda. You are number four. Oh, yeah, I've been gifted this beautiful bottle. Why not give a bit away, right? Why not? I'm in a privileged position to get some beautiful gin. Let's give some away. Four. Tina, number five. Emma, number six. Tia, number seven. Hello, folks. Happy Friday evening, the Friday before the party. So Tia, you are number seven. Seven. Remember your number, folks. Um, so what brings us here together today? By the way, you've got to comment. You've got to say hi within the next three minutes or it's just going to be these lot. It's just going to be seven people, which is lovely. I'm not how easy it's easy for me. It makes life much easier. Eight, Rachel. Hi, lovely. Your number eight. I love seeing these regular names. So thank you for letting us on your page, Second Son. Uh, number nine, Rachel McMurdo. McMurdo. Sorry, darling. I always pronounce your name wrong. Number, did I say number nine? Number 10, Stacey. Hi, Stacey. <laughs> okay, so this is the gin that brings us here today. This beautiful, um, I think I'm saying 10 for Tina. Tina, Tana, I can't remember where I'm at. Uh, beautiful uh, petite bottle with what an attractive neckline. I know it's a random thing to say, but what an attractive neckline and shoulders this bottle's got. So do you know what I am giving away again, Tia? Yeah, because I've been gifted this. So let's give 10% of it away and I'll pay for postage because that's the kind thing, that's the right thing to do. So take that, trolls. <laughs> take that uh hi robin you're number 11 good evening catherine you're number 12 so catherine number 12 is catherine hi folks uh okay okay so second son cheshire gin i'm on 12 i think for catherine uh a modern take on a classic recipe second son cheshire gin is the perfect pairing for any tonic the unique blend of botanicals, including lemongrass and cardamom, creates a refreshing and smooth taste. We do like um, we do like a slight spice, don't we? Pauline, hi, you are number 13. Um, it is a very attractive neckline. This is quite an unusual bottle. I've not seen a bottle of this shape before. Um, so 500 ml, 50 centiliters. This is batch number 60. Made in Cheshire. Uh, each bottle is hand distilled, labelled and bottled by John and Anna themselves in a small village in the heart of Cheshire. Uh, hi, Cara, you're number 14. Cara, remember your number, you're number 14. I'm going to give it another 30 seconds. Michelle, you're number 14. Uh, oh, no, sorry. <laughs> sorry again. Cara, number 14. Michelle, number 15. So Michelle Smith is 15. Carolyn, you are number 16. Let's go for a couple more. Um, 
We are truly proud of our gin. In fact, so proud that John was confident enough to put his face on the front. I'm meeting John next week. Of the bottle, we hope you enjoy it as much as we do. Uh, hi, folks. So we have got Wendy. You are number 17. Hi, Wendy. Nice to see you. Virtually see you. My name's Kate. Hi. Um, what a beautiful bottle. I am very, very impressed with this neckline. Again, we love attention to detail, don't we, folks? And look at that. Look at that shimmer in the bottle here. Beautiful kind of tealy, pale teal, duck egg blue background. Um, John looks great. John looks cool. And he's look at that for a gold beard. Second Son Cheshire Gin. They've got three different types of gin. This is their, I would call, original, made in Frodsham in Cheshire. Do you know what? I was expecting there to be a slight hole in the bottom and there's not. Oh, Laura. Hi, Laura. The gin is so nice. You are number 18, Laura. Welcome to Sip and Share if I've never, we've never met before. Um, okay, we are going to stop the numbers. You've got 10 seconds. If you haven't got a number, tell me now because I'm going to stop it and carry on and get drinking. So 18 is Laura Dora. Laura Dora. Ready? 18 is Laura. 18 is Laura. If you're not commenting, you're not going to get a number. Three, two, one. Okay, numbers are done. That is it. Numbers are done. <laughs> oh, Robin, no, you had a number. Okay, Robin, I'll give you 19. Oh, Beth, Beth's here, 20. Okay, 20. Robin, 19. Beth, uh, 20. Numbers done. Okay, Beth, uh, Robin is now 19. I am seeing Robin's comments. Yes. So we have got one to 20. Robin, I did give you a number, but we're giving you again. We're giving you 19, Robin. Okay, let's do this, folks. So I'm going to write here, no more numbers. We have one to 20. All right, let's put it on there. We have one to 20. Uh, and number 20 is Hannah Beth. Lynn, did you comment? Did you comment, Lynn? Did you comment? I hope you did, because I can't see it if you did. Okay, Lynn, I'll give you 21. Don't tell him. Don't tell him. 21 for Lynn. Got to stop. I've got to stop. Okay, make that 1 to 21. <laughs> That's it. We are in. We are done. 1 to 21. So we've got Lynn. 1 to 21. Stop. No more numbers. No more numbers. I'm not doing any more. Right. Let's taste this gorgeous stuff. So, uh, John and his partner, Anna, make this lovely, um, what a beautiful bottle we've talked about. Let's give this a taste. I love the fact they talk about lemongrass and cardamom. We know I love a slightly spicy gin. Um, I have got my tonic here. The perfect serve suggestion from John in the message and on the website was a Mediterranean fever tree Mediterranean tonic. I work with Lixia, these guys. So um, I'm using the Lixia. Uh, refreshingly light tonic and he suggested raspberries now thank the lord the only two raspberries left in the house are these frozen ones <laughs> so we're going with that uh, uh hi helen uh so lynn was number 21 okay right so let's give it a measure dare i use my posh measurer look at this Barman, baby. Let's have a smell and a taste neat as we always do. Oh, that works well. I'm going to sip it out of a uh, pourer. <laughs> I don't think you're supposed to do. Um, okay. Oh, that smells delicious. Do you know what? That's That reminds me of Brin's gin. Oh, that smells lovely. It smells a little bit spicy. Wow. That packs a punch. That tastes really thick. Oh, that is delicious. Who said that they know this, Jim? That is very, very good. It has got a very clear profile. <laughs> um, really, um, a really nice warm spice. That It's a very rich flavour. I know, posh. I'm dead posh now, folks. I don't know where you all think I'm not. Dead posh. No question, got a slight citrus, but re it's actually really warm to start with. Um, it's 42% Tina, 
Sorry, should have said that at the beginning, shouldn't I? Um, for that is very, very good. That is a very, very good gin. I you know, these are a small outfit in Cheshire. We have got, if you are in the membership squad, you get 20% off this gin. 20%. So if you join the Sip and Share membership squad, I am putting a code in there tonight to get you 20% off this gin. Helen, it is um it is fabulous. No, it's not potent, Louisa, the lemongrass. It's just there as a flavour, but it's very, very... It's just a hint of lemongrass. Very clear cardamom, rich, thick, smooth, all the way through to you. I am enjoying this gin a lot. I am really pleasantly surprised. From a gin I've never had... Sorry, folks. From a gin I've never had distillery i've never spent any time with don't know john um oh and the lovely card it's incredibly smooth this is a neat drinker there is a no question here that this is a neat drinker i am i am going in and i'm going to put more in i'm absolutely chuffed to bits with that let's go in a little bit more so let me put on here uh, so I think this is twenty nine ninety five for a five hundred ml bottle. Yeah, there is a little citrus, uh, uh, Beth. I agree. You wouldn't say the lemongrass is prominent at all. There is a citrus, but the lemongrass is really subtle. But the, it's very smooth. Oh, you guys tried this, didn't you, the other week? Cardamom packs a punch. It's very smooth and balanced, isn't it? It's like tastes thick and rich to me. Um, twenty. Oh, <laughs> sorry, when someone rings, 20% uh, off in the membership squad. Oh, can't you spell? Put that up on there. So let's give it a taste. Um, I would, I would probably naturally put, I think I did see him reference citrus with it. Um, as he said, a very slim slice of orange. I could drink it all night. Yeah, so could I. It's really good, isn't it? I think it's a I think it's a very clear, strong flavour as well. It's it's you saw me oh did my shoulder sounds like I was doing, yes, Robin, you will enjoy it. And you're in the membership squad, so we do well out of this, don't we? <laughs> packs a punch, packs a lunch, packs a punch. I could drink that neat, no question. No question. That is a very, very smooth, easy to drink. In fact, I might do it through a straw neat. These are the new Wise Sip straws that I've got. Um, we've got some exclusivity over that in the membership gang. Yeah, I would be tempted to go a bit more spicy. Pink peppercorns as a garnish. What a delight. Hi, Karen. What a delight. Very easy to drink. Very smooth. Proper gin. Um, quite a grown up drink, as you would imagine. It looks like a grown up drink. Very. It's got a very thick, smooth, spicy warming, but it not. Oh, no, <laughs> I'm really enjoying it. At no point does it make you go, oh, that's a bit much. If you like your cardamom, if you like your spicy, if you like if you like your slightly um yeah spicy wintry gins um it's got a, just a small kick of citrus so not like brins uh, hawkins distillery where it had quite a clear citrus and then quite a clear spice this is much more warming spice very very enjoyable i was i was i don't know why i thought it might be more gin hit than that it hasn't got it at all it's got it's pure and smooth and rich and very tasty um is it spicy as in adding star anise and or cinnamon? No, no, it's not winter spicy in, in that regard at all. More of the warming spice that you get from cardamom. Um, yeah, it doesn't it doesn't have spice in terms of like peaks. You know, you know, you taste something, you go, oh, that's got a spice to it. It's from the outset, from the smell, from the entire, your entire mouth is wrapped with a clear, ginny, warming spice, thick, smooth slight citrus tiny hint of lemongrass but cardamom and it's it's a really if you like those sorts of gins 
so, you know, you're, it, th this is not a fun citrus gin. It's not that. It's not kind of a playful gin. It's quite a, I kind of want to say quite a serious gin. <laughs> like, it's a, it's a special gin, I think. It's actually one to be, be slightly protective over. It is not a sharing party gin. It is a taking, taking itself quite seriously, I think. Um, but I'm turning it into a party gin, adding a straw. So they are also, from what they think, the UK's smallest distillery in Frodsham in Cheshire. Um, thick is an oily texture, thick. No, thick like a creamy, like a creamy ice cream. Not oily, no. Like it wraps your mouth. It feels thick in that sense. Not, um, um, yeah, that's probably the only way I can describe it is that it, it, it covers the entire, <laughs> the entirety of the inside of your mouth. Um, <laughs> smallest UK yeah the smallest licensed UK distillery absolutely uh, I think this is an absolute steal so it's 29.95 but it is a 500 ml bottle right so it's a 50 centiliter bottle it's okay it's okay dear it's a 50 centiliter bottle so 30 quid 50 centiliter bottle this is a premium gin of course it is everything we do is UK premium craft spirits um and in the membership squad we get if you join that which you can join on our website uh, you get 20% off in October with this one. This is a, this is probably gift Christmas gift market territory as well, I would be so bold as to say. Um, I will be buying one using the discount that I've managed to get us. Uh, it's very, very impressive. Okay, so um, I am going to be, yeah, it is great. I'm really, really so excited. Um, I am going to be interviewing John, maybe Anna as well, I'm not sure, but John next week on here. So on Wednesday night, maybe seven o'clock on here. So let's now find out who is going to win. Uh, yeah, it, yes, I agree, Laura. So I've used a skinny tonic. It doesn't need, it doesn't need anything. You don't need to add any more flavor to it. It doesn't need any, anything adding to it. Nice and skinny, light tonic. Gift to yourself, Stacey. <laughs> Um, okay, so let's see who has who my who I'm going to send um, fifty mil of this gin to. So I've written down some numbers, but not all of them. You guys have to remember your number. That is always the way. So we've got between one to twenty, one to twenty-one. Because I've got Lynn. Remember, I did Lynn on one to twenty-one. <laughs> buy back for someone else. I know. Buy for someone else and yourself. So one to twenty-one. So let me do a random number generator uh bear with me one second random number generator we've got one up to 21 and the winning number ready the winning number is number 18 which i think is laura 18 can you check for me who was number 18 so whoever number 18 is you need to message me your address and i will decant some of this gorgeous stuff and uh send it off to you and we've also got a competition launching tonight so who's number 18 we've also got a competition launching tonight to win a bottle of this so i'm gonna post about the competition straight after this but number 18 i'm gonna write on here ah, number 18 you are the winner who was number 18 not me. Sorry, Carolyn. Next time, next time. I'm going to do this all the time now. I love it. It makes me feel really good. I think it's Laura. I've got here Laura as in, I think the only Laura on is Laura Dora. <laughs> yeah, it's you, Laura. Yay. Congratulations. Awesome. See, this feels nice, doesn't it? I get given a bottle of gin, we talk about it, we get 20% off in the membership squad and I give a bit away. That's what we like. That's what Sip and Share is all about. Sipping and actually sharing. Um, congratulations, Laura. Uh, Laura, you will, if you can follow Sip and Share, I don't know if you do already, but if you can go and follow at Sip and Share UK, in fact, I'll write it on here. And then you can message me on there. <laughs> can't write and remember everybody 
If you go on to sipandshare.co.uk and you click membership, you can join and it costs you one pound for your first month. You can join and you get 20% off our five distillers this month. And then next month it will cost you two ninety nine, and you get uh, tw you get 20% off another five distillers, off tonics, off products. We've got loads of stuff going on. Uh, yay, congratulations, Laura. That's awesome. Well done. Uh, OK, so thank you so much for John and Anna for letting me boycott and take over your feed. I will pop the competition on the Second Sun page and on Sip and Share's page. Uh, thanks to everybody that's that joined in and watched and got a number. If you didn't, better luck next time, but you've got to be in it to win it and all that jazz. Um, so, Laura, yeah, drop me a message. <laughs> no, well, that's it. You, you really would go broke. That's what happens. The temptation is always there. Um, and we've got some exciting stuff coming up with gift boxes as well, gift tasting packs um, and a gin advent calendar, I think, as well. There's a lot happening. There's a lot happening. Um, all right. So I will see you over on uh, I'll see you over on Sip and Share. If you're coming to the party, I will see you tomorrow night at seven o'clock. Don't be late over on Zoom. Um, and uh, let's have a fantastic weekend. I am thrilled, thrilled with this gin. So thank you again to uh, John and Anna for gifting that to me. And I'm really pleased I can give some away to you, Laura. All right, everybody, have a lovely evening. Um, congratulations again, Laura, and I will see you all very soon. All right. Bye, folks. Well done, Laura. Bye, guys. <laughs>